Hey guys, Link Holden here, aka DVD Collector 96, and welcome to a new video on my YouTube channel. Okay, guys, so to continue the series on Gender Virgin today, I'm bringing you Gender Virgin, the complete second season on DVD made on demand. Okay, so this is the first release that I actually own from Gender Virgin, uh, it's from CBS DVD Home and it's a made on demand DVD. It was a little pricey when I got it, but no complaints, I love the show and I love to have it on my collection. Now, the only complaint that I have is, um, uh, later on I'm going to show you how the DVDs are stuck inside and that it doesn't come with a zip cover. And to be honest, the front cover art is a regular poster, but the back is a little bit lazy, to be honest. Let's continue ahead. Now, Season 2 jumps exactly where Season 1 ends, but on Season 2 they started playing a lot with the storyline and from Episodes 1 to 9 there is a lot of uh, timeline jumps, but they do reach the arc. I don't want to talk a lot about the seasons in the video right now because they will have a lot of spoilers, but just to resume, the big cliffhanger of Season 1 gets resolved here. She already gave birth, uh, it's a beautiful boy, and then the season goes from the struggle is on being a mom, they choose on immigrations because of Abuela's storyline, they develop a lot of the characters and the love triangle from season 1 continues to get messy, but in this season you actually get kind of a closure on that love triangle, they go a lot ahead with the same roster storyline, they do not have it a lot, but uh, Bridget Regan is not a lot on this season. But they continue ahead, and as usual, G Gina Rodriguez did an amazing work. But I have to be honest, not only Gina Rodriguez, every single character on this show does an amazing work. And uh, for the complete second season, we got a 22 episode season, uh, the same way as uh, season 1. And before they reached the last episode, it was renewed for a season 3. Now, this is one of the seasons that it ends uh, with the season finale, a lot, but a lot of cliffhangers. And like cliffhangers that you are like, oh my god, the last scene of this, a little bad story. I was in the US for the last part of this season. Uh, when I came from Cuba, I already watched a lot of the, if I'm not mistaken, to episode 9. Episode 10 was the first one that I watched in the US. And as I was recording it on the, I don't even remember the name of that. You know when you have like this, for example, Comcast, they give you like this little thing that you can record uh, the shows. That's what I was doing because my grandma was watching TV shows at that point, at that specific time, and she would give me the TV at like 10 p.m. and at the time I would catch up with all the shows of the week or whatever on the day that I was supposed to watch them. Now, I they reached the end of the season and when they aired the last episode, the television was broken. I don't know what happened. I just saw that I watched it really late. I couldn't sleep. At that point, Nick Holden was really active doing video edits, and I, as soon as I saw the Rose and Luisa storytelling and how the season ended, I did two videos at the time. I remember I did the Jane the Virgin Time of Our Lives, and then I did the Rose and Luisa Time to Go, something like that. The last scene from this season got me like, oh my god, when is season three starting? And I, as soon as it reached the last part, to be continued. That to be continued there hurt. Uh, it took me like, okay, breathe, patience, think about other things. I'm super impatient when I need to wait to watch shows. So a lot of these, uh, sorry, on these days I'm waiting a lot of shows. I'm not watching it as I used to do before. I'm actually waiting for all the episodes to be out and things like that. Now, uh, the complete second season, like I say, is the first one made on demand. You get there the front cover art. This is how the spine looks like. To compare it with season one, it's a little bit different because as you can see there, season one have like the number here. If they will have continued, I guess it will have been like that. But this is a CBS release and again, it's a DVD. Now, the back, not to complain, but it's just like, they just have the promo pictures there, the table with information, and then the sign notes is there. They didn't put any kind of quote from a magazine or whatever, but it's still. Now, let's go ahead and open it up. Okay, so the complete second season didn't come with any kind of special features at all. So, this is what I'm telling you about. 
as soon as you open it the disc came like this for example this uh, here you got this one but then you have like this thing right here and then all the these are the, like there are, are like pile you have to take one now whatever no complaints but still okay so in this case let me see if they come with club captions and things like that it's a five d set uh color the audio will be in english uh these these were created in compliance with uh, applicable dvd uh, specifications it doesn't specify if it comes with subtitles but i'm guessing it does and let's move ahead uh i hated it that it didn't came with any kind of special feature like deleted scenes or a gag reel from the season so on this one you get episodes one two four then on these two you get episodes uh oh wait it doesn't specify the number of the episodes let's start again on this one you get chapter 23 to chapter 26 on these two you get chapter 27 to chapter 30 on these three you get chapter 31 to chapter 35 on these four you get chapter 36 to chapter 40 and then on these five you get chapter 41 to chapter 44 and that will end the season funny enough i don't know why the dvds here uh, they have a, a barcode basically the dvds are uh, gender version on black it's a white dvd uh, the complete second season it specifies here that it's a DVD on demand. It's a CBS DVD. Here are the these numbers and then the episode right here, and a barcode which I don't know what it means. Uh, the season you can get it on Amazon.com. Uh, it's not that pricey anymore. I think you can get it for like twenty something dollars, but it sometimes doesn't get to thirty. And the season is available on Blu-ray as well, but I think those are out of print because I keep checking at least on Amazon and they haven't got any copies back on the stock for a while now, so I'm pretty sure they are out of print. But for now, that will be all for today's video. Like I always say, I hope you guys are enjoying with this new kind of content in the channel. If you are, please let me know in the comments, give me a like, and please subscribe to my YouTube channel so we can keep this family growing. And see you guys again soon on a new video.